Hello everybody, I wanted to address a subject on uh, RV living. It is such a wonderful life, but it is not free. A lot of people misunderstand when people say that they're living free. They're living free spiritually, free to roam, free to see the country to live the way they want to. And uh, it's a wonderful life. But it is not free. Our rigs cost money. To maintain them cost money. I don't want you to get into this life and think that you're going to live without paying any money. You can't forage for food, really. To get enough food to live, every state you go to, you got to buy a fishing license, hunting license, and you're not in one place long enough to have a garden. I have made a plant, and uh, that's my little garden. But there is free campsites. Some of them you have to pay an entrance fee to get into the park but there is a lot to learn before you get into this life it's a wonderful place to be there's so many different sites so many things to discover so many great people to meet I cherish every moment of every day Even the breakdowns where I have to work on my rig and figure out where to get a tire or something like that. It's just part of the life. So, if you want to be an RVer, I say go for it. But make sure you have either skills to make money, some kind of an income, A little bit of money set aside in case you have a breakdown because there's nothing worse than being stuck beside the road with everything you own in a rig and not having the money to move forward. You can't always depend on other people. You have to have your own skill sets. You have to be willing to learn and move forward. I'm not trying to discourage anybody from this life. There's work out there. There is always somebody to help you learn something. You know, if people see you helping others, they'll help you. It's just the way life is. And you can tell the people that are just out to get money from other people and people avoid them like the plague but I really hope that you take the positive parts of this video because RV life is wonderful but you need to plan ahead you need to you know, if, if you get a RV and you know nothing about it and you head out on the road and something goes wrong, then you're going to have troubles. But if you do a little bit of preparation, a little bit of research, then you're going to have a great time. Y'all have a wonderful day. Am I the only one? Other than what I've been gonna be lately. All I have to do is think of me in my peace of mind. Is that the way we live? I'm tired, <laughs> I'm tired of looking around or who I'm supposed to be. I don't wanna be anything other than me.